Zhong Mei. What do you think about this outfit? This is the Hanfu. It's the traditional Chinese dress with a history of thousands of years. It represents the continuation of Chinese history into modern society. And wearing this dress is the perfect way to experience Chinese culture. And look at this place. Isn't it just the perfect backdrop? It's so Chinese. Tea makes Chinese life more enjoyable and is also a cultural and historical tradition that has flourished through the ages. Is it really so amazing? Today, I will take you to discover the magic of this one simple leaf. I'm now in Huangdu village of Anji County, Zhejiang province. Over 20 years ago, this was an impoverished village with a per capita income of less than 1,000 yuan. Now it has become China's number one white tea village. Last year, with the per capita income of 49,000 yuan, most of which came from white tea or related industries. White tea cultivation has now expanded from Huangdu village to the whole county, enriching some 200,000 people across the county. The brand value of Anji White Tea now exceeds 4 billion yuan. Historically, Chinese have relied on their natural habitat to live their lives. Take where I'm at, for example. From what I've heard, there's not much room to grow food here. The locals call it Qishan Yi Shui, Liang Fen Tian, which means seven mountains, one body of water, and two fields. The locals rely on the natural habitat to grow tea and thus prosper. We have a lot of trees. This is the Huangdu Trees Center. Last year, our trees income was 4.2 million. The people's income was less than 5 就超过了五万元。那么我们真正做到的这个绿水青山，就是金山银山。few years, China has been fighting poverty all across the nation. Over 10 million people have been lifted out of poverty each year. China has become a model for poverty alleviation. I spoke to the head of the village, and he said that the Anji people who have shaken off poverty have also helped other impoverished areas. They donated 15 million of the best tea leaf seedlings to impoverished areas. They hope that this leaf can help those who are still in need and bring them hope and prosperity. In addition to planting and processing, Anji white tea is also entering the service industry. A simple leaf enriches the people. The locals say that this is the road to green development. After taking a stroll down this road though, I found that there were many detours. Imagine yourself soaring across the bamboo tops, presenting a marvelous martial arts performance. Do you remember the movie Crouching Tiger, Hidden Dragon that made Oscar record books in 2001? Well, this is where parts of the movie were filmed. In the past, gray limestone was the lifeblood of the Yutun village. 
mines, and cement factories were everywhere. There is a saying, Kao Shan Shi Shan, which means that people relied off of the mountains they lived next to. Such practices with short term benefits made Yutun village richer than other villages. However, years of excessive mining gnawed through and tore apart the once green mountains. Dust and smoke overcast the village all year round. When it rained, mudslides charged down the mountains, crushing houses and burying livestock along the way. Though the village profited off of cement and mining, the locals had to pay a steep price for destroying their local environment. Yutsun villagers shut down polluting factories in a last ditch attempt to save a future of green development. People here, with great determination, have taken advantage of the village's vast bamboo forests and bounty of natural resources to boost the local economy. They have also made great efforts to fuel up eco leisure tourism. Ranging from homestay and agritourism to rafting. In recent years, tourists from neighboring cities such as Hangzhou and Shanghai, and even from across the country, have flocked here for a refreshing vacation. Lucid waters and lush mountains are invaluable assets, a simple line that has transformed Yutun village. This has also become a guiding principle for an increasingly eco conscious China. Under this principle, many places have experienced better lives greener lives, and wealthier lives. This concept also provides many lessons for other countries to draw from. The United Nations Environmental Assembly in 2016 pointed out that the concept of sustainable development is universal. Lucid waters and lush mountains are invaluable assets, literally provides a China model for the world. <laughs>